Hey everybody, Diamond Grandma here. I just want to get on here right quick and do a quick video. I have got a tip for y'all. I'm sorry, I'm moving you around. I bought this from Walmart and it is Static Guard. Y'all, I have sprayed my trays down with Static Guard using this stuff. This is the best stuff. You know, I've always used a dryer sheet or whatever, you know, trying to stop. And I have a grinder. And I usually have trouble with, like, when I'm doing Diamond Dots and Diamond Art Club, a lot of times their drills will stick together. I have found that out doing their stuff. And I even sprayed my grinder. And y'all, it is wonderful. So, I wanted to get on here and show y'all. Get to Walmart, get you some Static Guard. It is wonderful. I spray my trays down, and I take a little bit of paper towel. I spray them down, and then I just wipe right over the top of it real light with my paper towel. And I have sprayed the one out there at Mama's. I, when I bought this, I sprayed the one I got out there at Mama's, and I left it to sit overnight. And I didn't wipe it out. But if you're going to use it right quick, you know, you might want to wash it out. I mean, wipe it out a little bit because it will be a little you know moisture whatever on it but spray your trays down your grinders whatever this stuff works now i haven't kitted up with it yet and if i get a hold of some drills that are kind of like sticky or whatever diamond grandma is going to spray the bag and take a paper towel and wipe it and see how it works but y'all this is the best stuff spraying your trays I never thought it would be, but I was in Walmart, and I thought, I've got to have some dryer sheets. And then I seen, oh, static guard. That would be perfect. And some of y'all may already use it. I don't know, but y'all, I have tried it. Wonderful, wonderful stuff. And I wanted to get on here and show you so y'all would know in case you uh, wanted to uh, try it or whatever. But I sprayed my trays down, and like I say, I sprayed my grinder down because... I have put, like I say, my beads in my grinder, and I would turn it around and get them separated, and um, they would all clump together and stick in the grinder and wouldn't come out. So what I did was I sprayed my grinder down and um, put my beads in there, and I did it, and y'all, they all come out without sticking. So like I say, static guard. It don't cost very much. I think this was like $3 and something. If it was even that much. I can't remember. But I thought, oh, because it don't take a whole lot of it. And it'll last you a while. So, I just want to get on here and tell you about my static guard right quick. My little tip about it. I love y'all. Y'all keep diamond painting. And get you some static guard. Y'all know diamond grandma's going to try it. Y'all know. <laughs> I ain't beyond trying anything. Diamond Grandma is brave. I'll try it one time. I always say that. I'll try it one time. You never know. But anyway, I love y'all. Keep diamond painting.